Well, there was a landmark study co-authored by Dr. Alicia Fasano, who is one of my favorite researchers, and the group um, investigated the the lead re- the lead author in the study is not Dr. Fasano; it's Sapon, uh, but the group in this study investigated the effect of gluten on intestinal permeability in different groups of individuals. Okay, and the title of the study is Non-Celiac Gluten Sensitivity, the New Frontier of Gluten-Related Disorders. And again, like I said, it's Apone et al. It was a 2011 paper in the journal Nutrients. Now, a quick note that when I keep saying intestinal permeability, we're talking about what's commonly called leaky gut. That's the lay term. And what leaky gut can lead to is immune activation, poor digestion, gut inflammation, neuroinflammation, allergies, food sensitivities, and more. All of the neurological symptoms we looked at earlier can be an effect of this so-called leaky gut.